East Chicago, Indiana, a city of 30,000 people tucked away in the northwest corner of the state. Known for its steel production, cultural diversity, and its rich and unrivaled basketball tradition. East Chicago is a, a unique town, and, and I think basketball is what moved and shaped East Chicago. Basketball has always been the thing that has brought the pride to East Chicago. Whenever you think about East Chicago, you think about high school basketball. It's what gave the community an identity. It gave the community uh, hope, and it gave them something to cheer for and, and something to look forward to. And, and in some ways to believe in. East Chicago's boys basketball teams have won four state championships while producing six NBA, one ABA, and over 100 Division I basketball players. It was one generation, one generation of athletes passed the baton off to the next. And there was always this high school um, dedication and love for the high school and that was passed on to you. And then you took that love and passed it on to the next generation too. Playing for the school was something that uh, was more than just playing the game. I mean, you were playing for everybody that was behind you and everybody that was before you. So it was, it was more than just putting on a uniform. You were putting on a tradition. The art gym held between six and 7,000 people. And Technically, it was probably over 7,000 most games. Literally, people were in the, in the aisles watching ball games. It was people, there was 10 deep, people standing 10 deep, just trying to get a look, and it was in every, every corner. Uh, I know they said the capacity of that gym was 6222, but you know, if there wasn't 9,000 in there sometimes, you know, I, I, I can't count. Whenever the sections came around, and uh, we played each other particularly, they used to scalp tickets. You couldn't get tickets to them, okay? <laughs> and if you couldn't, you bought them on the street. They're just like a professional game. They scalp tickets. It was more than a game at the time. It was more than just a high school game. It was a, for a lot of people, it was a way of life. Names like Barado and Bradley have helped create the story of the greatest basketball city in a basketball crazed state. When you saw the people out there at the games, and they, you know, they got that chant, you know, "We are EC," you know, "We are EC," and it's like, it's unbelievable. 